Hi guys, Patrick Agnetti here of NoiPigX.com. The Samsung Galaxy A71 just came out, an enormous Galaxy device for work and play. But for today, we're focusing on the play aspect of the Galaxy A71, here in our game review. Before we proceed, let's take a look at the hardware that we'll be working on here. It features an enormous 6.7-inch Full HD Plus Super AMOLED display, a Qualcomm Snapdragon 730 octa-core processor, Adreno 618 GPU, a flagship level 8GB of RAM, 128GB of storage, and a fitting 4500mAh battery with 25W fast charging. And if you're interested, it also comes with a quad camera setup on the back as well as a 32 megapixel punch hole camera on the front. Now that we have the hardware out of the way, let us start. Bear in mind that we run this test under optimized power mode, the most fitting setting that we found since the Galaxy A71 doesn't have a dedicated power or performance mode. We also used an app called GameBench to get the average frame rate and frame stability as we test these games for at least 10 minutes. First on the list is Mobile Legends, the most popular and competitive game in the industry today. Despite being the most played title, Mobile Legends is actually not the most resource-hungry game in this test. That's why we were able to run it with all the graphic settings set to high and the quality at ultra. Under those maxed out settings, GameBench recorded a steady average frame rate of 60 FPS with 96% stability. That is the highest frame rate that the display supports. This translates to very smooth gameplay at stunning graphics. With that, it will now purely up to your skills to win the game. No more excuses. Now let's step it up a bit further. Here we have Call of Duty Mobile, another popular game but with more demanding graphics requirements. But despite its advanced graphics, this game is actually very optimized, which is why we were able to run it at high graphics quality and high frame rates. We also have the real-time shadows enabled and graphics styles set to realistic. Call of Duty was so optimized that we were able to run it at an average frame rate of 58 FPS with 83% stability. It results in ultra smooth gameplay with stunning graphics, no frame drops were visible even in big explosions and intense combat. This next one is for the basketball fans out there. Here we have NBA 2K20, a mobile alternative to the popular console and PC game. With its highly optimized construction and the powerful hardware on the Galaxy A71, the game was playable at high graphics settings. Almost all of the tabs are set to high, although the depth of field effect and cloth simulation are off and the crowd quality is set to medium. Under these settings, the game was playable at an average of 51 FPS with 98% stability. It should feel as smooth as the Mobile Legends, although it dips when the game is heated up or as it transitions to cutscenes. This one is a little tough. Not a lot of people might play Asphalt 9, but its fast-paced and action-packed nature could be really too taxing for the processor. Hence, we're including it in our tests. Unlike the other games, you can fine-tune the graphics settings on the Asphalt 9. You're only given a chance to pick between performance, high quality, and the one that was pre-enabled default. The game ran at a steady 30fps with 90% stability. Obviously, the game doesn't support the full 60fps standard, but still, this means that the game ran at its best on the Galaxy A71.
So, can you game on the Samsung Galaxy A71? Well, that's what you just saw. The answer is a big yes. Its powerful Qualcomm Snapdragon 730 processor and the Adreno 618 GPU, partnered with a generous 8GB of RAM, can handle pretty much all types of games available without a hitch. The best part is, you can enjoy all this game on a large and vibrant 6.7 inch Super AMOLED display. There's also the enormous 4500mAh battery that guarantees long gaming sessions. If you're interested on this device, the Samsung Galaxy A71 is available nationwide for a price of 22,990 pesos. Again, this has been Patrick Nerton from NoiBeaks.com. For more detailed look about the Galaxy A71, including our full review, you can check out all the links available down below. You might also hit the thumbs up button, share this video if you like to subscribe if you still haven't. Hit the bell icon to get notified every time I post a video. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And yeah, thank you for watching.